Hey, y'all, come in, I can blow your lawn. Yeah! <laughs> no, I'm fine. Huh? I'm fine. What? I'm not going. Oh. But yeah, guess what I just found out? I watched the news just a little while ago. And uh, I had my brother tell me about this, too. I used to sit in West Virginia. For all you people in West Virginia, lock and load, people. Lock and fucking load. Take them son of a bitches out, no hesitation. I don't give a fuck who you are. You take them out regardless. You aim for the head and the chest. Nothing else. Nothing else. No foot shots, no wounding them. Kill them. Dead. Eliminate them. Take them off this fucking earth. Because they're in our country. They're in our cities. They're in our fucking town. I'm from South Carolina. I go up to West Virginia. And I'm planning on coming up to West Virginia this... This, um... This, uh... Thanksgiving. If I see one of them ISIS motherfuckers. Ooh, wee. I'm gonna have fun killing that motherfucker. Then I'm gonna take their gun and then I'm gonna look for their fucking buddies. And I grew up in a military family. I started shooting guns when I was four or five years old. As I stated in one of my other videos, I've been shooting guns for a long ass time and I'm not afraid to drop someone dead in their tracks. So if you think you're hard and you wanna fire at me, feel free to, cause I'll return fire. I have no fear of anyone or anything that opposes a threat to me with a gun. If I ain't got a gun, I'll use my bow. If I ain't got my bow, I'll use my hands. If I can't use a knife, I'll still use my hands. If I get close enough to you, you're dead. Either way, I'm snapping your neck. I've got ammo loaded up. My guns are ready to rock. They got clips in them. They've got rounds in them. My mags. I got a 45 round AR-15 mag, and my brother is gonna get that AR, and I'm gonna get my SKS, or I'm gonna get the Sega, and I'm gonna have fun blowing their heads off. Because if ISIS thinks they're gonna sit back and have fun and kill my people and y'all's people if y'all have family up in West Virginia y'all show them this video please show them this video let them know what's going on in West Virginia because people in Charleston where country folk are and the rednecks and the hillbillies no matter what you are you better lock cock and ready to rock you better hold your shit down with no hesitation you drop them all dead. I want to see them executed. I want to hear about ISIS being taken down in West Virginia. And if they make it to Georgia, and they make it to South Carolina, they will not make it out of Carolina alive. Nor Georgia. Because all I got to do is make a couple phone calls, and I'll have all my boys here. But I'm pretty sure all my boys will be holding down their home. And don't bother me one bit. You hold your house down no matter what it takes. You get shot, you get the fuck back up, and you take them out. No hesitation. They show no fear to their enemies. They try to kill you, you kill them before they kill you. I use strategies to my advantage. The fuck was that? But, for all you people that don't know how, you're gonna defend your home in West Virginia? I got one thing to say. Lock your doors, wait at that fucking door. They kick it down, you wait for that last guy to come in. You snap that neck, you take that gun, and you blow them all the fuck away. That's all I can say. You either knock them out, kill them, and take that gun, and you fire that gun. Because all I can say is, I got one, two, three entrances in my house. And I'm not 
going to take any shit from an ISIS member. I will gladly take their fucking lives and take them off this earth because one simple reason, you're in my country, you're in the good U.S. of A., and we'll put our boots in your ass and put you in the ground six feet under. <laughs> and if they attack on this weekend, nope, they're not going to have any fun. I'm going to be having all the fucking fun. Because they're going to be screwed when I get a hold of them. And I'm going to have fun with them. I might even fucking torture one just for the hell of it. Because I don't care. If you're a part of ISIS, you are pathetic. You cannot destroy us. We are America. We hold our ground. We hold our properties down. We will not stop until the last of you are dead. It will not bother me one bit to put one of you motherfuckers out of your misery. And they got ladies of ISIS too. So for all you women out there, if you're filling up for a challenge, go fuck them up. Feel free. I applaud you for fucking them up. I want all of you people in West Virginia, if you ain't got a gun, sit behind your door with a knife. Wait for them. Kill them. Take them down. I don't care. I want them gone. Out of the U.S. No longer causing any more terror. They've been in a fucking Islamic states and taking people out and their families. And they're saying, no, don't kill my family. And that's all they want to fucking hear from you. They don't care. It's like a drug to them. They want to see you hurt. They want to see you in pain. They want to see you cry. They want to kill you. They don't care. I have an uncle. United States Marine Corps. 12 years. Force recon. Owns a P90. Has his own snipers too. He even has a ghillie suit that he has from when he was in service. My papa. I have his old double barrel 12 gauge. My brother has his flag. And I will hold it down. I will show no mercy to ISIS. You want to fight? Well, I'll give you one. I will put you out and in the ground. You can call me insane. You can call me crazy. You can call me stupid. But I want them gone. I don't want them on this earth. I want them done, killed, taken out, executed, tortured, whatever it takes. If it means a citizen has to give up their life, at least they tried their best. And I hate that ISIS is in West Virginia. And if you're in my area, you can come join up with me. I don't care. We'll hold it down. Take them out. Kill them all. Don't bother me one bit. But I've shot guns my entire life. And it's not going to bother me taking anyone out. It will never bother me eliminating my opponent. I'm ready to go to war in my own country. It does not bother me one bit. I'm ready for him. I'm ready. And I will show no mercy to my opponent. I will kill at all costs. If I lose my life, oh well. If I die, oh well. If I get shot, 
oh well. If I get blown up, oh well. At least I protected my country knowing that I was not going to let anyone stand in my way. And for all you soldiers out there that want to step on the American flag and just join for the fucking benefits, you will never redeem yourself as a soldier to me. You're probably the ones who are going to join up with ISIS. You're probably the ones that are going to fucking join up with them. And then you have no pride as calling yourself an American soldier. You can call yourself a soldier all you want. You're not a soldier to me. A person like me, I'm basically a soldier, even though I haven't even joined. I'm willing to stand by my country's side. I'm willing to give my life for it. I'm willing to take a bullet for every last one of y'all. All 30 of y'all subs, I know you may think I'm crazy, but does not bother me one bit wanting to take an ISIS member out. If you agree, feel free to comment below. And if you disagree, go join up with ISIS. Come and meet me. Then you'll see what I'm really about. You may think I talk a lot of shit, but I walk the walk and I talk the talk. And I'm not afraid of you. Trust me, I'm far from afraid of you. I'm not one bit scared of you. And if you think you're hard enough to join up with ISIS and get your ass kicked by me, feel free. Have fun. Thumbs up your dumb ass. And for all you soldiers out there that stand by the American flag, I salute you. And for all you veterans out there, lock and load. Because we're going back to war. I use strategies, knowledge, and I've seen how ISIS works. I know how they fight. I know how they operate. They don't operate very smart. They're very retarded. They're mental. They're scared. And they will be scared whenever I start firing at them. And I will not stop until the last enemy is eliminated, gone, taken off this earth, killed, tortured, does not bother me one bit. And if you feel the same, like this video. If you don't, feel free to dislike it. I'm ready for you, Isis bring it on. That's all I gotta say. No matter what you are doing, 24-7, always pack a lip. Hold your, hold your property down. Hold it down. Don't stop until they're all eliminated. And I'll catch you on the next video.